What's going on, YouTube family? This your boy T Love. Like, comment, subscribe, and you know if you comment, I'm gonna get back to you because we family, and that's just what we do. So look, UK Flock fans on Reddit, y'all better calm that shit down because y'all fucking his case the fuck up. Even his lawyer is saying it. Y'all messing the case up by threatening the judge. And by doing that, that's making it credible to the court to not release the witnesses. For them to investigate the witnesses. So now k Flock, the lawyer, can't even investigate the witnesses or get statements from them or nothing because the court's scared that something might happen to them. That's y'all fault. You see? But y'all care about this motherfucking, man... Y'all be bullshitting. And you motherfuckers be doing shit for these fans that don't get no fuck about y'all. Because if they gave a fuck about this nigga, they wouldn't be threatening a fucking judge over his case, which could make her biased to this nigga on the case. Y'all stupid. Yo, if I was K Flock, man, I swear to God, I'd be like, man, fuck my fans. For real. Like, y'all niggas tripping. And the lawyer, like, you know, he could probably beat it, but it's kind of making it credible that the court keeping the witnesses because now the judge getting threats. The judge getting, yeah, man, y'all should do this, do that. Are y'all that stupid? Are y'all that? Y'all be too fucking fanned out sucking these rappers' dicks, man. Now that you know y'all want to send this dick up the road. Straight up, man. Shut the fuck up. Let that shit play out. That's what he got his bread for. That's what he got that high-powered lawyer for, motherfucker. Shut your ass up. Because if you don't, you're going to fuck this little nigga over, man. This nigga looking at some real, real bad shit. Real, real bad time. Now y'all playing, putting death threats on the judge and shit. Then what you going to do? Put death threats on the jurors? Y'all playing with this dude, freedom is life. And he a young brother. Come on, man. Stop that dumb shit, man. Y'all be too fanned out, yo. Y'all be too fanned out. Taking sides on motherfuckers, beefs and shit, man. Too fanned out. Stop this shit, man. It's getting these young brothers and shit. Y'all be too fucking fanned out. That shit crazy. Y'all gonna fuck around and send this nigga up the road. Even the lawyer saying it like, yo, y'all need to chill. I ain't making this shit up. For real. I ain't making this shit up. Kick flock lawyer right now I'm talking about, man, yo. Motherfucker need to chill this shit out because it's fucking the case up. I should have been had all this shit. I should have been had to discover all that shit. I ain't got none of that shit. Because they, they, man, the court's holding that shit. Got that shit sealed. And, and got a protective order on that shit. And even the, even the uh, prosecutor said, it ain't coming from K-Flock. It's coming from you motherfuckers. Don't believe me? You can pull this shit up. On YouTube, man. And Google this shit. Y'all tripping. You so fanned out. Puck sending a threat. Write the nigga a letter. Tell that nigga to calm down. Get out here. But come to some freedom. And, and do music. And stay out the streets. If you really love him. You really a fan. Write him. Put money on his books. I don't hear about none of that shit. None of that. But y'all sending threats to a fucking 70 year old judge. Man, get your shit together, motherfucker. Straight up. Look, man, 
family. Motherfuckers gotta do better, man. Choose your circles, man. And these rappers, man, you gotta understand that these fans don't care about shit. Only thing they care about is who you beefing with, who gonna die. That's it. Are you gonna die or the motherfucker you beefing with gonna die first? That's it. That's all these motherfuckers care about. They don't give a fuck about you. So stop throwing your life away for them. Stop throwing your life away for clout. Stop throwing your life away to go live. Stop throwing your life away to show motherfuckers you so fucking tough. Gang, gang, gang. K-Flock wouldn't be in this position if he wasn't stupid, a hothead, and used his fucking head and used his fucking brain. But on that note, stay safe, stay dangerous, keep your pole. If it's a pistol, keep it in the holster. Get body armor. If you at war or whatever, even if you ain't at war, get body armor. Because before you know it, this country will be at war. You see how this shit going. You see how this shit going. Fuck you mean. Straight up. Y'all see how this shit going, man. This shit done got real out this motherfucker. It's getting real for everybody. Even the ones playing it safe.